हेलो फ्रेंड होप यू आर ऑल ओके यू आर ऑल एंजॉइंग योर लाइफ एंड यू आर ऑल्सो एंजॉइंग वाचिंग माय वीडियो सो वेलकम बैक टू डॉक्टर अरशद नदीम अवान अल्ट्रासाउंड एंड रेडियोलॉजी वीडियोस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द डिफरेंशियल डायग्नोसिस ऑफ द स्क्लीरोट्रिक बोन लीजन बट इट वुड बी सॉलिटरी इफ देयर वुड हैव एनी सॉलिटरी स्क्लीरोटिक बोन लीजन सो यू शुड हैव टू लुक फॉर द डिफरेंशियल डायग्नोसिस like first of all there is a possibility of developmental abnormality like uh, there may be bone island or maybe fibrous dysplasia or the second differential includes new plastic like metastatic deposits depending upon the patient's age lymphoma also in elderly age or maybe osteoma osteoid osteoma or osteoblastoma it may be vascular like bone infarct or uh, it may be because of infective etiology like uh, osteomyelitis of gary uh, it could have been traumatic as well like uh, callus formation could be also sclerotic or it may be because of uh, uh, some other reason which might not be known like idiopathic cause uh, that may be a pages disease so let's have a look for these differential diagnosis of the solitary sclerotic bone lesion Solitary sclerotic bone lesion can be of uh, developmental origin and it includes bone island. Uh, it's also called as inostosis. It's quite easy to recognize on the bones and especially if it is uh, within the medullary area can easily be found in the neck of the femur. Uh, the second is fibrous dysplasia. It's another common developmental uh reason for the solitary sclerotic bone lesion next differential is new plastic for the solitary sclerotic bone lesion and the topmost is the metastasis uh, most commonly seen in uh, prostatic cancer and also in breast cancer the second is a uh, lymphoma these both are the malignant uh, potential and it appears to be sclerotic bone lesions although osteoma osteoid osteoma and osteoblastoma may also appears as a sclerotic bone lesion uh, sometime uh, because of the healing process or already healed benign or malignant bone lesions may also appear as a sclerotic bone lesion Uh, so far the lytic meds are concerned uh, followed by the radiotherapy or chemotherapy uh, this may appear as a lytic uh, primary bone sarcoma may also appear as a solitary sclerotic bone lesion solitary sclerotic bone lesion may be of vascular origin and specially bone infarct will appear as a solitary uh, sclerotic bone lesion Trauma is also included uh, in the differential for the solitary sclerotic bone lesion, uh, especially when there is a callus formation, uh, especially a transverse density around a healing stress fracture may appear as a sclerotic bone lesion. Infective etiology may also contribute in solitary sclerotic bone lesions, and uh, that would be because of sclerosing osteomyelitis of Gary. Uh, that will typically appear as a sclerotic bone lesion a disease of uh, unknown origin idiopathic origin for the solitary sclerotic bone lesion is a pages disease it will appear both uh, lytic and sclerotic bone lesion but in a differential of the sclerotic bone lesion the pages disease will also be included